Does your sales team have the right sales tools they need to help attract and close deals? I'm not just talking about a brochure and a business card. In today's competitive world, they need a whole lot more than that. In this video, I'll define some of those sales tools that every sales rep should have and talk about the responsibility of leadership in making sure they have them. Keep watching. Hi, I'm Bob Bundy, president of Roque Services Group, and I've been a sales representative, a sales manager, a sales VP, and I worked with many salespeople and managers around the country. In this video series, I give you concrete tips and strategies you can use right away to be a more effective sales manager and help your team close more sales. As a sales leader, one of your responsibilities is to make sure your sales team has the correct sales tools to get the job done. Now when I talk about sales tools, a lot of people automatically think about collateral, things like brochures, case studies, feature lists, and business cards. And no doubt, those are important sales tools, but there are other tools that can be just as important, things like product samples, frequently asked question documents, access to customer reference accounts, and a comprehensive analysis of the competition. It can also include direct access to company resources such as your product specialist, your engineering, your delivery, and your customer service departments. And last, your sales reps need access to quick feedback on decisions. You know, there's no better way to lose a deal than to have to check with the office or ask my boss and then take two to three weeks to get back to the prospect with an answer. If yours is a sales-driven organization, Everybody on the team needs to be willing to contribute to get the answers that drive more sales. As a sales leader, it's your responsibility to arm your sales team with the tools they need and keep them current and relevant. Help your team close more sales. Now, it's your turn. I'd love to hear your feedback. What type of sales tools do your reps have access to? How often do you, as the sales leader, make sure those tools are updated and relevant? Please share your thoughts in the comments section below this video and let's start a dialogue. Did you like this video? If so, please be sure to hit the like button below and also subscribe to my channel to watch all of my sales related videos, including the others in this sales management series. If you want us to notify you whenever we publish new content for salespeople, head over to the website and tell us your email address. We only use it to let you know when new content is available.